What's up, guys? Hey. It, this is Noah and myself. We are vlogging our Saturdays from now on at the Academy. I hope you guys enjoy. All right, cool. So, Puck's out, our technique this week. Um, let's just get straight into it. Um, Puck's out, first and strip it of context, is generally used as a defensive technique. So, if someone's throwing a punch towards you, and it's just used as a defensive technique. Um, however, it can be used offensively and very well. Um, so this movement here can be used offensively to the side of the head. So the target would be the eardrum. So you want to bust the eardrum there. There. So if I do actually crack through it, yeah. it's still all this protection. Uh, yeah. Do the wrong one again where you're kind of going separate pieces. Sorry. Just so you can see how yeah. Yeah, there's a hole there. Yeah. Never want that. Yeah. Alright, switch. Daddy's gonna teach the class. 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 It's like a chain motion. Now, I want to put that together with a punch as well. So with a punch parry. One, two, and then on the third parry, you're going to parry punch. So you just get used to coming forward and not getting stuck in a defensive cycle of parry, 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 because that's just not what it's like. In Wing Chun, we're always on the offensive, but this is more just of a skill, so you're building in the punch parry into your defensive um, movements. So one, two, parry punch, and you go one, to punch parry, yeah? So you can play with both, whichever one you prefer. Just get into a rhythm mode. Look at the camera, see the camera's swimming, say cheese. 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 Just do it from this position here. Do the parry punch, yeah? And then do the punch parry. Just in sequence, it feels better. So I just want you to feel it. Yeah, like that's, that's the one signal that he prefers to do. Makes sense because yeah. it's only if this is working. So exactly. And generally, and generally speaking, right? Like, you know what I mean? Like, generally. Yeah, generally, yeah. 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 Can I have a go with Big Marky Mark? Not the way Jono likes Big Man. That's the one signal suggested. Punch your parry. You suggested that. Hey, look, he's got something for me. Oh, Mama! Oh, for my mouth, yeah? You want to put it in? Ah. Oh, thank you. Um, nom, nom, nom. Um, <laughs> in your intention. Sensing the whole space. So we sense the whole space our body is in so that we can make connections from the center and influence the body. So relax muscles, rotate joints. Band. But also to develop presence. The sensations in your space can only be in the moment. You can't sense your body later. Centered in your intention, sensing your space, and now sinking. Let everything release down through the head, face, neck, shoulders, back. Chest, arms, hips, thighs, knees, calves, shins, feet, everything sinking down. So the term they used in Hong Kong was tum, so which means sink. So it's like a sinking intention. So that all the muscles release, any tensions relax, and there's also a letting go-ness to it as well. It's like you're letting go of any fears, doubts, worries, complaints, blame, anything happened for this moment as well. So you're just letting go, relaxing, releasing, sinking. Mel, what's it taste like? It's really nice. Um, yeah, it tastes like honey honeycomb, but it's not too sweet. Chocolate, really nice. Honeybee. Is that okay with 
Dude comes out to the really shape of dynamic pressure. There are certain connections in the body from the centering of the tension to releasing the physical tension in the body. The internal guys would get that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah
Sick. Thank you, right? Right. Fuck yeah. Bye. 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 Who's breaking off here? I think you're in the chest. In the chest, Mark, you're better than that. Go, go, go to actual viable striking points. Yeah, mate. And now we're about to have some dinner. Yeah. At the end of the day. Say hi, Josh. Hi. Ah. Yeah. At our yeah. local fish and chip shop just down from the dojo. So, see you in our next video. Bye, I love you.